where news comes first. This is WECT News at 11. Good evening, everyone. We thank you so much for watching. I'm John Evans. And I'm Daniela Hankey. Crews will be back out on the water tomorrow in Brunswick County, searching for a boater missing now for nearly a week. No one has seen the 23-year-old man since his boat started taking on water last Thursday around North Myrtle Beach. First responders and search teams have covered hundreds of miles along the coast of Brunswick County. They did find some items belonging to that missing boater. WCT's Mara McDilton spoke to members of the Oak Island Water Rescue Team today. They were just one of the many agencies from North and South Carolina assisting in this search. It's been almost a week since the 23 year old boater was last seen in the North Myrtle Beach area, but crews tell me that they are not giving up yet. South Carolina's Department of Natural Resources is now the lead agency in this search, but local, state and federal agencies from both states are now involved. Crews from Oak Island down to North Myrtle Beach worked on the water, getting help from residents who manned their personal boats. The Brunswick County Sheriff's Office helicopter covered areas all along the coast looking for any sign of the missing man. The chief of Oak Island's water rescue team tells me they're trained for situations like this. They operate with the hope of bringing the missing man's family some closure. I just hope the family gets closure here soon. And that's truth. I mean, it's heartbreaking to wondering what's where their loved one is. So we hope they find some peace at some point. Now crews here in southern Brunswick County are expected to be back out on the water tomorrow morning as they will pick back up with where they left off today. In Oak Island, Mara McJilton, WECT News.